హలో ఎవ్రీ వన్ వెల్కమ్ బ్యాక్ టు విద్యా టీవీ ఈ పర్టికులర్ వీడియోలో మనం టిఎస్పిఎస్సి అసిస్టెంట్ ఇంజనీర్ సంబంధించిన మోడల్ క్వశ్చన్స్ చూద్దాం అండ్ సబ్జెక్ట్ వచ్చేసి బ్రాంచ్ వచ్చేసి సివిల్ ఇంజనీరింగ్ అండ్ ద సబ్జెక్ట్ ఈజ్ డిజైన్ ఆఫ్ స్టీల్ స్ట్రక్చర్స్ వెరీ మచ్ ఇంపార్టెంట్ ఫర్ ఏఈ ఎగ్జామ్స్ టిఎస్పిఎస్సి ఏజీ ఏఈ ఎగ్జామ్స్ సో ద ఫస్ట్ క్వశ్చన్ ఈజ్ అ బీమ్ ఈజ్ designed as a structural member subjected to what it is subjected to transverse loading option 2 transverse loading next question a circular column section is generally not used in actual practice because of what a circular column section is generally not used in actual practice because it it is difficult to connect beams to the round sections that is why a circular column section is not used in actual practice because it is difficult to connect the beams to the round sections next question is a column splice is used to increase what a column sp splice is used to increase the length of the column is used to increase the length of the column next one a riveted joint may experience a riveted joint may experience shear failure shear failure of plates bearing failure all these are true so a riveted joint may experience shear failure as well as bearing failure also so option d is the right answer next question bending compressive and tensile stresses respectively are calculated based on what bending compressive and tensile stresses are calculated based on gross area and net area based on gross area and net area ante gross area for the bending compressive and net area for tensile stresses next question diameter of a bolt hole is usually taken as what diameter of a bolt hole is usually taken as a nominal diameter plus 1.5 mm nominal diameter plus 1.5 mm effective length of a column effectively held in position and restrained in direction at both ends is what effective length of a column effectively held in position and restrained in direction at both ends is 0.67 into length 0.67 into length the effective length formula for position and restraint in direction of in both ends what is factor of safety formula factor of safety is the ratio of yield stress to working stress factor of safety is the ratio of yield stress to working stress next question for a cantilever beam of length l built in at the support and restrained against torsion at the free end the effective projecting length is what for a cantilever beam of length l built in at the support and restrained against torsion at the free end what is the effective length it is l equals to 0.5 5l 0.5l the effective length is l equals to 0.5l next question right restrain again it is the same the effective length is 0.5l next question for a cantilever beam of length l continuous at the support and unrestrained against torsion at the support and free at the end what is the effective length is equal to for a cantilever beam of length l continuous at the support and unrestrained against torsion at the support and the free end is given as 1 l equals to 3 l l equals to length of the beam l equals 3 times the length of the beam effective length so next question is for a column of height l fixed in position and direction 
बोट एट इट्स टॉप एंड बॉटम वॉट इट्स एफेक्टिव लेंथ फॉर अ कॉलम ऑफ हाइट एल फिक्सड इन पोजिशन एंड डायरेक्शन बोथ एट इट्स टॉप एंड बॉटम वॉट इज इट्स एफेक्टिव लेंथ इट इज हाफ ऑफ द लेंथ ऑफ द कॉलम हाइट हाफ ऑफ द कॉलम हाइट सो दीज आर सम ऑफ द इम्पॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन वेरी मच यूजफुल फर् टीएसपीएससी एई एग्जाम अंड डीटेल डेप्त के मुझे फस्ट बेसीक्स ने ऐज इट इज एई एग्जाम इज बेस्ड ऑन इट इज डिप्लोम लेवल एग्जाम काबाटी सो कांसट्रेट ऑन बेसीक्स मोर राधर दैन गेटिंग इन टू डेप्थ सो सो डेफिनेटली दीज क्वेश्चन विल बी वेरी मच यूजफुल टू यू Yeah that's all for this video thank you please do subscribe to my channel thank you